What is going on everybody? It's a beautiful day just outside of Spokane, Washington. Today I stopped at Northern Quest RV Resort. I always want to tell you guys about RV resorts that I like, that I would recommend. This is my second time staying here now, so I've been able to get you guys a pretty good review. Now, it does seem to be windy a lot here, so that's why I'm recording this inside. Huge thanks to the RV Glass Guru for sponsoring today's video. RV Glass Guru specializes in large one-piece windshield replacement. They have a team of installers that service the entire state of Arizona, as well as a nationwide network. They put a new windshield in my Tiffin over a year ago, and I couldn't be more happy with the service I received. The RV Glass Guru offers discounts to veterans and first responders. Thank you to all of you that have served our country. first time I accidentally got upgraded to one of their premium sites and that was super nice or it might be called a deluxe I'm not really sure deluxe or premium or something like that I have stayed here during the week and during the weekend there's a big difference in the weekend there was a lot of local people and a lot of children kind of playing so kind of a different environment and then in the week it seems like it's just more people that are passing through uh, it's not far off of I think about five or six miles off of Interstate 90 they also have casitas or like little cabin style housing here on site as well so if you were in your RV and had family that wanted to come visit and stay at either the resort over at the casino or the cabins right here on site they're set up for that and they also have like an event area over here and a nice swimming pool nice clubhouse a lot of cool stuff going on now this is site number one that I'm in here and this is this is another level here, guys. A great little stop. It is a gated community. It's right next to a casino. So there's all kinds of sites in this park. There's a lot of pull-throughs, and then there's also some back-ins, but I had originally reserved a pull-through and somehow got upgraded to that nice back-end site, but for folks that have travel trailers or fifth wheels or coaches and stacker trailers, I know pull-through sites make it a lot easier. So right now it's Monday morning and a lot of the sites cleared out, but over the weekend this park was 100% full with uh, mostly travel trailers and I noticed a lot of them have Washington license plate, so it seems like a lot of people were local. Nice dog park over here, huge dog park. Little fire pit areas and whatnot, TP. And I like all of the little details, like the nice light post. Two really good sized dog park, one for large dogs and one for small dogs. Just a lot of open area too. So this is a super nice little sitting area. Little uh, cornhole beanbag toss. Man, I don't know what the deal is with this teepee here, but they've got a teepee here. I guess you can go inside there. You know, these kids can just go in there and play or something, I guess. No, I don't think that's for you, Sadie. Come on. Real nice bathhouse, and I like how everything is designed. It's all brand new. Looks like brand new laundry facilities and then restrooms as well. Really a cool facility overall and a good place just to stop and check out. So I thought I'd make a video about Northern Quest RV Resort just outside of
Thanks again for all of you that are coming along on the journey with me. I appreciate all of you that like these videos and subscribe to the channel. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again.